Oh, very good evening to you. Dinky new, it's just me, Scotty McClure. And of course, we are live on the big one. Excellent Facebook Live, the one everyone's talking about, the one everyone is watching, one of the world's great broadcast platforms. I'm Scotty McClure, and I've just popped up to say dinky do to every single one of you. Fantastic. It's uh, Sunday night, nothing gets past me, and we have lots and lots to be talking about. And lots and lots to be looking at. And of course, you can share this broadcast and let everyone know what is what. Excellent stuff. There you are. Christopher Love, Andy McCrory, Hamish Carr. Lovely to have all you guys with me. And dinky do, as we say. Fantastic stuff. <coughs> Good evening, says Christopher Love. Susie McGuire, dinky do. Lovely to have you with us. Your shows are absolutely outstanding, by the way. I've been listening all morning. Morning. Fantastic. There you are. Good evening, Scotty. And Dinky Doo. And uh, Susan Forrest is watching. Alan Freebon, Julianne Scott. Welcome, 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 I say, to Scotty McClure's Sunday Night Pop Up. Just for you, Dinky Doo. It seems a wee while since we've actually all been together. Scooby Doo, this is Mike Castle. You and McIntyre is watching. And a very warm welcome to every single one of you. Great to have you with us Sunday night as i say nothing gets past me and we are made for each other fantastic stuff good evening from eric and ali from canada alison mcmillan in canada i say dinky do alison in canada fantastic wonderful uh johnny hannah a lot of people speak canadian with a scottish accent have you noticed that yeah i'm from canada um, Hamish, dinky do, let's have a corker tonight. We always do, Hamish, and I've no doubt tonight will be absolutely no exception. At 10 o'clock sharp, dinky do. Uh, Ian Kerr there, fantastic, wonderful, wonderful. Now, guys, it's up to you to share. There's Gordon Sterling. Hello, stranger. Where have you been? My favourite show, do you sing? Mike Castle, I sing anything you like. Join in. There we go. Keep together, I always say. <laughs> we do a bit of that as well. Fantastic. So there you go. Uh, so as I say, yes, it's up to you all to do the sharing. I shall do what I can. But you know what it's like here, for goodness sake. Give us a shout out, Scotty. A big handsome daft to you. There you are. Stephen Hamilton. Dinky too. Uh, do you think the Eurovision Song Contest should be part of the Brexit? <laughs> James Clough, good afternoon, good afternoon James, where are you watching from James when it's afternoon, I think we should be told, do let us know, dinky do let us know, Lisa Trina, dinky do, Brian Murray, lovely to have you with us as well, hello pal, hope you've had a good weekend, says Thomas Hamilton, I have Tom, and I hope you've had a good weekend, I was out for a walk with the dog today. I've posted it on Facebook for you. Hunter, George, Dinky Doo, Anita, Dinky Doo, it's Sunday morning. Excited to catch up with last night's thrills and thrills. You make me laugh, Scotty. Anita, you are a gregarious lady, I say. It's a privilege and a pleasure to make you laugh. James Clough in Castle Milk. Oh, I see, yes, it is afternoon in Castle Milk because people are just kind of getting up. So there you are. Evening, Scotty. This is Darren Wood. Thank you, do. Hello, Scotty. I was at the Model Railway Show at the SEC today, says Ali Yogi. Wonderful, Ali. What sort of things did you see? I used to have a Hornby Dublo. Do you remember the Hornby Dublo? Good evening, Scott, from Ian and we Val. Ian Cochran. Dinky do, Ian. Welcome, 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 I say. Uh, dinky do, Scotty, says the lovely Susan Forrest. Dinky do, Susan. And uh, good evening, Scotty, says Tony Mack. And Susan sent a wee kiss. Mwah. There you are. Send your kiss back. Good evening, Scotty. Dinky do from Susan in Rochdale, Greater Manchester. Susan Crossley. Lovely to have you. On in Manchester, Susan. Tell ten to tell ten to tell ten to tell ten about Scotty McClue popping up just for you on Facebook Live. Hi, Scotty. Hope all's well. Says Ian Johnson. Richie McCusker is watching. Custer McShane. Hi, Scotty. Dinky do. This is a, a Celtic house. So there we are. We've got a puppy and my son wants to call him Larson. I wanted to call him Lisbon. What do you think? I don't know. Larson's a lovely name, isn't it? They're both nice names. Andy Whitton, Douglas Brown. So there you are. Um, what 
what, why not go for Larson? Larson, come here, you. <laughs> hello, hello, says Daniel Trainer. Hello, Daniel Dinky Do. And uh, lovely to have you on. Billy Hunter, welcome, 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 I say. Dinky Do from Fleet in Hampshire. I know Fleet, Jerry Ma, a lovely part of the world. I know Hampshire very well. I know Winchester and um, Fleet, of course. Fantastic stuff. Lovely, lovely part of the world. Linda Ireland says, Dinky Doo, Dinky Doo, my dear. Lovely to have you here. And uh, what have we got here? Ali Yogi says, Hornby, where they are so much real future and a number of rail groups from across the world, including the new Jersey Railway Group. Tremendous. And Ali, is it still quite the thing? Is everybody still fascinated with railways? I've always wondered about that. Helen Torley. Hello, Dinky Doo. Paul McGuinness. Dinky Doo to you, Scotty. Dinky Doo, Paul. Lovely to have you with us. Tell 10 to tell 10 to tell 10. Addy Thompson's watching us. Welcome, Addy. This is fantastic. Let me get on to this and see what I'm doing here. I was going to see if I could do a wee bit sharing. Excuse my coupon. Good night. Up for a close swatch as they say but um, I'm trying to get sharing here and it's proving a wee bit elusive hold on I'll have to have a sip of my drink mm -hmm. oh that's lush you've got to watch you don't knock it over that's a problem. I'll put it somewhere out the road. There we are. Put it over there. And that's fine. What's the weather like today? The weather has been beautiful, Mike Castle. You'll see I did a little video of my dog walk this afternoon. So you should see that on Facebook. Thanks, Scotty, for such a kind shout out. Dinky duty you from Anita Page in America. Which part of the States? Are you in Anita? Tell 10 to tell 10. Let the world know. We've not just got one nation watching. We've got every nation watching. Tremendous. Charles McLaughlin. Dinky do. Dinky do, Scotty. Says Martin. Muskos, Jogbeck. Uh, dinky do. Uh, off to Boulogne, sir, there. With Fash from Lark Hall. Excellent stuff. Rosemary Mark, you can't beat the fosh, uh, I say. And uh, Rosemary Mark, dinky do, Andy Kerr, dinky do, welcome, welcome, welcome. Now, let me get this right. Yeah, I'm just dashing over because if I can get this right, then we can get some sharing done for you. I think that's important. Sorry, I keep disappearing, but I'm just going to, there we go, that's better. And then I can see what's what. How's the radio show going, says Andy Kerr? The radio show is absolutely outstanding, Andy. It's just, it's blown me away. I wasn't expecting it. I knew it would be a success and a resounding success. But I didn't expect to just be blown away by it. Just fantastic. Uh, dinky do, Scotty. You're still searching for a bonnet big enough for that impressive bonnet. Gordon Robertson, what are you like? Hi, Scotty, just come to see if you know about the Linen Bank and the Gorbals. I grew up there, Linen Bank. Uh, do you mean the old British Linen Bank, the BL, that was taken over by the Bank of Scotland? Good evening, Scotty. Got to see you. Looking well, sir, says Charles McLaughlin. I am in excellent health, Charles. So they are wonderful stuff. Very, very good, Nick. Could not be in better, Nick. Not bad for 34, I say. Excellent. Right, can we get some sharing going, please? Can everybody share? This is important. You'll have to do the sharing because uh, I forgot to bring my device with me uh, tonight for the sharing. So you'll all have to do the sharing. I'll just pop up because obviously I'm on the radio at 10 o'clock sharp. But I thought we'd have a quick pop up. Ah, there we go. Excellent stuff. Right, there's my clue. Share. And um, as I say, sorry if you're getting a swatch of my coupon. Share. Right. So that lets everybody know what's happening there. And uh, yes, very much so, Charles McLaughlin, and I hope you're well. There's Ian McManus popping up. Anita says, I'm watching from L.A., West Side Valley border, near Hollywood, but I'm from the East Coast in the U.S. Fantastic stuff, Anita. Excellent. So Anita's watching us um, beside Hollywood in Los Angeles. Excellent. Lovely, lovely, lovely. Good to know. Tip them the wink at Hollywood and say, hey, guys, you'll never have seen anything like this. Get Scotty McClure a wee cameo role in your next blockbuster. So there you go. And uh, we can do all sorts of things, you know, fantastic. Excellent piece of professional acting. 
Uh, thanks, Scotty. I need to be careful, Mrs. Mac's watching as well tonight. Yes, thank you do to Mrs. Mac. Excellent stuff. You do need to be careful. I'm just going to share uh, with one or two of the groups as well. Uh, Scotty, long or normal sausage? Andy, that's always a big one for me. I like both, but uh, the lawn has it for me because you can pop it on a roll. A wee bit of brune sauce or a wee bit of tomato sauce. Would you say brune or tomato, red or brown sauce? Do tell. Spill the beans. And uh, your ordinary sausage, we can pop a couple of them in a roll as well. Very nice. A wee bit of black pudding and an egg. Uh, Ronnie Crumlin's watching. Careful, Scotty. Maybe Scotty does L.A. So there we are. Ian Johnson, dinky do. Fantastic. No, but it's great. There's Anita sitting in Hollywood watching Scotty McClure. That's all right, isn't it? And uh, Scotty Kringles, dinky do. Lovely to have you with us. Of course, very, very important. Tell 10 to tell 10. Now, let's get the viewing numbers up tonight. I want to see the biggest ever. So every single one of you get tap, 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 de tap and sharing and sharing. Brune sauce, of course, says Lisa Anderson. Now, does Lisa speak for everyone? Is brown sauce better than red sauce? Or does it depend on what you're actually having it with? Tell us. In North Hollywood, a residential commercial village style area with lots of millennials. Millennials. Excellent, Anita. Yes, well, are you not a millennial yourself? You look as if you might be. Uh, Rab from Bigger. I was listening to you in Tenerife, says Robert. Excellent stuff, Rab McMinn. Excellent. JP McCarran, dinky do to you. Come and join us, I say. If you've just joined us and you're wondering what on earth's going on, you're watching Scotty McClure, the first lot of the internet and the world's top broadcaster. I can't help that. So there you are. It just, that's the way life is. Uh, Stuart Wilson, dinky do. Lovely to have you with us. And a very warm welcome, I say. And uh, come and join us live. Very, very important. Broom sauce on a square sausage. Tomato sauce on bacon, says Lisa Anderson. Now, do you agree with Lisa? So I'll maybe make a note of this. That's broom for the square slice. <coughs> Pardon me, a wee bit of a chist. Broom for the square slice and tomato on bacon. Broom sauce all the way, Scott. He says, Conor McBride, he's having none of it. He's a broom sauce man. It depends on what you're having it with, says James Bowman. Excellent stuff. Talking about L.A., uh, I love the way the Americans say Scotland. It's like Scotland. Yes, unlike our own broadcasters, they tend to say Scotland. Scotland. Well, Scotland have scored, obviously. Uh, brown sauce for everything, says Susan Forrest down in Lancashire. She's a lassie from Lancashire. Thanks so much. I'm actually mum of two millennials, says Anita. Wow! Amazing. Well, you look fantastic. So there you go. Tremendous. So we'll call you Millennial Senior. Wonderful. Uh, Scotty, say hello to Nathan and Hannah, says Andy Kerr. Nathan and Hannah. Dinky do from Scotty McClue. Excellent stuff. So there you go. A quick shout out. If you want a wee shout out, it was funny. I met somebody recently and said, what's your show all about? You just seem to be shouting out all the people's names. I said, well, that's why we call it a shout-out show. People, you know, come on, interact, and we give them a shout-out. What is your problem? It's so funny. You know, people say, what's this all about? So it's all about Scotty McClue and you. Oh, <laughs> you know, because people are so formulaked at the moment. They're so formulaid up. They can't get their head around it that you just have something that's different. And it's information, education, and entertainment at its very finest. Let me do a bit of sharing here. What have we got here? Um, share to a page. So I think I'll share to the Scotty McClue page. That'll let you know what is what. That's coming up. Uh, roll on square with tatty scone and brune sauce. Who said that? 
<laughs> Frank McCallum, a roll on square with tatty scone, brewed sauce, and raw onions. Wow! Who likes raw onions on their roll and tatty scone? Dinky do, Scotty. Still games coming on. I'm sure it is John Warren Duff, but Scotty McClue's on as well. So there you are. So you've got to decide which part of the quality entertainment, which part of the quality fence are you going to follow? Um, my dabbing mucker, good to see you, said John Cameron. Absolutely, John. We can dab. Thank you, too. Evening, Scotty. This is Mark. Fair evening, Mark. Lovely to have you with us. And thank you, too. Wait till I share this. Just going to share this to Scotty McClure and let everybody know that we're on. Fantastic. You've got to stay cool when you're doing this, you know. Not for the faint-hearted. I can't suddenly panic and think, oh, I don't know what we're doing here. <coughs> Michael, you dinky do. John Cameron is laughing, laughing his head off at Scotty McClure's antics. Tut, tut, tutity tut. This is a very serious program, you know. Uh, forgive us, Americans, we've been... What have we got here? Anita, forgive us Americans, we've been given an overdose of the Emerald Empire and an undereducation of Scotland. Absolutely, Anita. Now, you would love finding out about Scotland. Okay, the old Emerald Empire, yes, the Emerald Isle, absolutely, there'll be a fair bit of that. And uh, what have we got here? My wife says to me, I don't listen to her. I had to ask her to repeat it. <laughs> Scotty, Scotty, we do, do, do. Scotty, we love you. Thanks very much, Andy. Ian Johnston, a fried egg roll. Now, this is culture, folks. Listen to this. A fried egg roll with sea salt mustard and tomato sauce with a coffee is absolutely brill. Excellent. We like that. Wonderful. Frankie Bill K. Dinky Doo, lovely to hear from you. I hope you are well, you top, top, top man. So there you are. Wonderful. Used to work with Frankie Pilkey. Absolute genius of a man. So there you are. Wonderful. Um, with horoscopes and dreams and all these things. Absolute genius. Lovely fellow. Frankie Pilkey, I say dinky do to you. Hello, Scotty, you're a top man, says Brian McCaffrey. So are you, Brian McCaffrey. You are a top man, I say. Even the Scottish have been given an undereducation of Scotland, says Lisa. <laughs> I know, but we do have fabulous, fabulous education, best in the world. Say hello to Kevin, Declan and Bev. Dinky doo, says Kevin Kelly. Kevin Kelly, dinky doo to you from me, Scotty McClure. Lovely to have you with us. Tell 10 to tell 10 to tell 10. I'm going to do some more sharing. Can you all share? Have you all shared? And let me know when you've shared because I will know. I will know. I can see the figures going up here, you see. Excellent stuff. Right, wait a minute. Share to a page. We're not doing a watch party. Um... Share. Right. I've got this one. I'm going to share to a group now. This takes a bit of work. You've got to be quite smart for this one. Lord of Meekles watching. Dinky do. Lovely to have you with us. We'll give you a wave. We wave to Lord of Meekle. How fantastic is that? If you've just joined us, Scotty McClue's live just for you. Sunday night, nothing gets past me. Alistair King. Dinky do. I have to dash at some point because... I'm going on the radio, but don't let that deter us from chit-chatting, uh, sharing a group. There we are, sharing in a group. I must get this beside me next time, so I don't have to do all this peering, the peering, uh, you know, a bit of peering, we say. <laughs> Wonderful. <laughs> now, right, uh, the group. So the group is... GL, wonderful. This is it. I'm just going to share this to our group and let everybody know that we're on. If you can all share as well, that would be fantastic. Um, there we are. Excellent. And that will just come up. Good. 
and then this will come up and I can I can share this and then we are laughing. Alistair King, welcome, welcome. Paul McGuinness, a shout out to Mig and the gang, please. Nice tie, Scotty, says Kevin Kelly. Do you like that, Kevin? The old Labradors, very nice. I got given one in red and one in green. So tonight I thought I'd pop the red one on. Uh, hi Scotty, dinky you do, says Alistair King. Dinky you do to you, Alistair. Lovely to have you with us. And a very, very warm welcome, I say. Share Scott, happy days, says Ian Cochran. Lovely Ian, thank you very much for that. Can everybody else now share? Very, very important. Let us know what's happening. There we go. And uh, we're just coming up to nine o'clock. So everybody will be coming to join us as well. Fantastic. I'll just have another sip of the magic nectar. Ho! Oh. oh, that's absolutely lush. It really is lovely. Very, very nice. So there you go. A little sip of the magic. Looking forward to hearing you on the radio later, says Tony Mac. Absolutely. 10 o'clock sharp, Tony. Don't be late. I say very, very important. Just going to do another bit of sharing. You'll wonder what's going on here. But uh, McClue's well connected in the old social media, you see. So we need to have everybody knowing what's what. I've missed the last few shows. I've been too busy says Alistair King. Is busy the same as being hissy? Could you have a busy fit? Uh, miss the last few shows. Absolutely. Don't worry about it, Alistair. Not a problem at all. They're all in catch-up. Uh, links all the way with the brown catch-up, says Rab. For those of you who are into YouTube, get on to Scotty McClue's YouTube channel. Fantastic stuff. There's about 500 videos and audio for your delight and your edification. Good evening. Nice to see you. Just been busy, says Angela Goodley. I know, Angela, we're all busy. And it's fantastic that we can manage a few minutes just to get together and have a wee chit-chat throughout the world. I'm talking here to the marvellous Anita Page and Anitas in Hollywood in the United States of America. And um, Have you ever had a deep-fried Mars bar, Bruna Red Sauce for that? I've never have. I don't, does such a thing exist? Or did somebody just do that for a laugh? That's what I've always wondered. So I don't know if there's such a thing as a deep fried Mars bar, but uh, it sounds incredible. There you are. But I don't know that you would have sauce with it because the old chocolate, although I've noticed people are now having toast and a wee bit of butter and some chocolate spread. There you are. I won't mention the name of the chocolate spread, uh, you know, but it's, uh, it's quite interesting. And I remember asking some young people if they'd ever experienced any disasters. And one of them said, yeah, we ran out of naming the chocolate spread. <laughs> Fantastic. So there you go. That's what we like. But no, I don't know what sauce you'd put with that. There's Wilma Flynn. How excellent. Good evening, Scotty. It's been a lovely day here in Dundee. You're up at Dundee. I hope you're day starving. And I hope you've had a pay. Excellent. I'm a clues pay. That would be the thing. But excellent woman, lovely to know you're there. And dinky do to all our Dundonians watching. I send love to Dundee. It's a, a city that needs to be valued and valued and valued and loved. Not just by the Dundonians, but throughout the world. I mean, for goodness sake, jute, jam and journalism. The home of Urwale and uh, Fat Bob and Hen Brun and Daphne and Grandpa and uh, Desperate Dan, Minnie the Minx, they're all up there, you know, fantastic stuff. Um, do you want to tag Alex and William Cochran in your video? I don't know. Uh, deep Fried Mars are not good. To a chili piece, uh, says Alistair King. A chili piece every day, says Alistair. Right, what have I got here? Hold on, just going to do tiny bit of sharing, just to let everybody know what's what, and um, that'll come on. Oh, there we are, share in a group. Lovely, and that'll come up, and then I can share you yet again. Can every single one of you share and share and share this right now, just to let everybody know that Scotty McClure's live, and uh, it gets on. I want everybody watching, so I want these numbers up. Up, 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 up. Let's get up around the 100 mark 
watching live. And then it goes into thousands. It's fantastic. So there you go. So come on, get sharing. Let's really go for it. I'm just going to pop this group name in SC. This is the Scotty McClue group. I hope you're all members. Fantastic stuff of Scotty McClue's group. That's what we want. Big style. Uh, Sunday night, if you've just joined us, you're watching Scotty McClue. I'm the first lord of the internet. And I am, of course, the world's top broadcaster. And uh, I can't help that. That's just the way it is. That's life. You'll just have to suck it up and move on, as they say. Uh, Stephen McFarlane, Dinky too. Live with it. Just live with it. That's what it's all about. Be reasonable. Live with it, you know. Can I help being the world's top broadcaster? No. Can I help being the first lot of the internet? No. So there you are. Live with it. Suck it up. Look for closure. We do get all that, don't we? You know, people are always on about that. So there you go. Na, 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 na. Uh, can someone sp uh, spot you a cup of tea, darling? My family is the Ross clan. Great Uncle Jasper Ross. So there we are, Jasper the Friendly Ghost, a revered member of Chicago Police Force amidst racism 50 years ago, and his sisters, Ethel, Beatrice, just a minute. Um, hold on a wee, this is fantastic. Ethel Beatrice Brady, which is why I feel an affinity to prefer Scotland. My first daughter made a first trip across the pond to see the Queen. Some may presume, but it was simply a shorter flight than going to see her grandma in Ivory Coast. Is that not fantastic? So there we go, Anita. Tremendous stuff. We sent you strength and love and um, you know these wonderful pioneers that cut through the race barrier how can you possibly have racism when there is only one race the human race and we're all members you know what i mean it's not rocket science is it for goodness sake so there we are fantastic i'm talking to anita anita's out in hollywood in the us of a in la tremendous stuff with the millennials and she is the mom She's the mom, I thought Anita was a millennial, but she's the mom of two millennials. Now, Ross, Ross and Cromarty, the Ross clan, big, big stuff over here. Roche, fantastic stuff. So excellent. So big name, the Ross clan, wonderful. And um, right from the north of Scotland there. Uh, you, can you throw out a 20 story flat? Says Lisa Anderson. Oh, you canny fling pieces at a 20 story flat. 700 hungry wings will testify to that. Fantastic. And uh, what about Wee Jammy? A uh, Wee Jammy piece? Yes, absolutely. Very, very important. Is that a pocket watch on your chain, Scotty? Um, no, no, this one's something else on the end of the chain. So there you are. Excellent stuff. But don't pull it in case I flush. Anyone know any Scottish people, uh, places, restaurants to inform me about in Los Angeles? So there we are. Fantastic. Well, of course, I remember uh, a friend telling me that uh, when they were out in Los Angeles, somebody said, what is it you do? And he said, uh, I'm an actor. And they went, oh, yeah? Which restaurant? <laughs> Fantastic, isn't it? Because obviously a lot of actors and actresses have to wait tables and do all sorts of things, suffer for their art. You know, I mean, McClure, you don't want to hear all the stories from an old guy who's treaded the boards for many, many years. Oh, tell you a lovely story. A guy was going to all the tiny, tiny towns up in the North American Native Indian Territories. And he was going through, and the reservations and what have you. And um, somebody said, uh, he said, uh, could you tell me what was around here in the 1920s and 30s? And he said, yeah, well, I can't. They all say Americans, oh, yeah, but I can't. He said, but see the old North American Native Indian sitting there under the tree? He can remember everything. So the guy goes over and he goes, Oh, 
and the old North American Native Indian goes, oh. and he says to him, now, he says, I just want to do a test with you because apparently you're a memory man. He goes, hmm. He says, what did you have in breakfast Christmas Day 1930? And the North American Native Indian thought for a while and he said, egg. And he said, great, fantastic. Okay, he can remember what he had for breakfast on Christmas Day 1930. So he went away on tour and he came back. Five years later, the old North American Native Indian was still sitting under the tree. And he went up to him and he said, how? And he said, scrambled. Do you like it? There we are. Anyone know any Scottish people to place in a restaurant? So that's that for Anita. Neil O'Gormley Dinky do. You tell them, Scotty. Do you believe in independence, Scotty? Says Stephen Anderson. Well, I believe in independence economically. I'm not any kind of great flag waver or nationalistic type of character. I'm apolitical. I'm not a political animal. But um, economically, Scotland could do very well independently, of course. Um, hi, says Gordon Prince. Yes, yes, I like your tail. Does it mean you've been out hunting or you attend pedigree dog shows? Tremendous stuff. Yes, all that stuff, Anita, in my day. Bit of a crack shot, old McClue, but of course, I don't like clobbering any animals, so I don't shoot. So there you are. But my family used to shoot for the pot. So there we go. And of course, I uh, have uh, uh, beautiful gun dogs, fantastic, black Labradors, field trials champion. Wonderful. That's what it's all about. And um, that's that's what happens. Do you like that one there? I think that's great. So there you go. And the other lovely story was the old North American Native Indian chief. And somebody said, you know, chief. We want to take you on an aircraft. You can't just spend your life hanging around here. He says, we want to show you some other places. He goes, hmm. So they went to the airport, and uh, they said, to, he said, this is our chief. And uh, the airport staff said, uh, do you have a reservation, sir? He went, yeah, but I've come here because I want to get out and see more of the world. <laughs> Do you like it? Wonderful stuff. How does it feel to be a phenomenal internet superstar, says Lisa Anderson. Well, you know, Lisa, I, I'm such a normal guy, if you call this normal, you know what I mean? Um, so, so I don't really know. Um, I've always just been genuinely in awe of my fame, of how it takes off of how the world has said, this will do us. And it doesn't matter if it's young people or old people or everything. Everybody loves Scotty McClure in some way or another. And I find that incredible. And we have a huge, huge young following as well. So the television companies can't get their head round it. They say, we want somebody who really can get down there with the kids and be hip and attract a youth audience. Nothing. We put on Scotty McClure. Everybody tunes in. And it's because I don't have any kind of target. People say, what's your target audience? I say, the world. What's your show about? World unity. Who are you targeting? I'm not targeting anyone. I'm talking to the people. You know, and that's what's cut through and made broadcasting totally different. So this style of personal and interpersonal broadcasting is the future of broadcasting. I sometimes wish I still had, uh, you know, another 20 or 30 years so that I can actually achieve great things. That's the thing, because we've only scratched the surface. People say, but you're an international superstar. I say, but we've only, we haven't scratched the surface yet. Yeah? So there we are. I'm down in Winning Pals, says Thomas Hamilton. Brilliant, Tom. I'm part of that young following. I'm young, honestly, says Lisa. I believe you, Lisa. 
Dinky doo. Andy, have a wonderful evening, Scotty, says Stephen Anderson. Dinky doo, Stephen. Tremendous. You tell it how it is. You don't twist it to make it look better than it is. Straight to the point, says Alistair King. We do our best, Alistair. Can everyone do another share, please? I know it's a lot to ask, but can you all just click share? I'm going to do it with a Scotty McClue fan group and see if we can get these numbers up big style. Because I'd like to see this touch 100. See the little box at the top? I want to see that touch 100. So can every single one of you start sharing and sharing and sharing and sharing? And type, 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 type. Tell people, by the way, I'm watching Scotty McClure. He's live on Facebook Live. Richard Wood, Dinky Doo, Alan Humphreys, Dinky Doo, lovely to have you with us. Come on, folks, let's get that number up there. So let's do a fair old bit of sharing, and I'm going to share as well again here. I will have to go at some point, but not until we reach 100. Come on. Um, Alan Humphreys and Richard, lovely to have you with us, Dinky Doo. Senior video, says Thomas Hamilton. Absolutely. Was that the video this afternoon, Tom, out for a walk with a dog? Tremendous stuff. Or is that the Scotty McClue video? Which what, which particular video? There's an audience with Scotty McClue, but it's 25 years old. Woo! How about that? Fantastic. Now, mm. ooh, that's lush. Tremendous stuff. Wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. And um, yes, uh, so let me know which one it is, Thomas. And uh, I can tell you a little bit of background for that. Fantastic. There we go. We're on the move again. How's the radio going, says Alistair King? The radio is outstanding. Uh, we're on tonight at 10 o'clock sharp. So there we are, Nation Radio. Tremendous. Hey, Scotty, what's happening? Says Mahid. Uh, Mahid Wahid. Fantastic. Majid. Majid Wahid. Did I call you Madge? Is that best? So there you are, Majid Wahid. Match. So there we are. Uh, yes, pal, the one this afternoon. Ah, yes, Thomas, out for a walk with the dog in the Scottish countryside in the spring sunshine. How fantastic is that? Anita says, how can I help you with the Tell 10 to Tell 10 to Tell 10 campaign? I'll post it on my business page on Facebook. You economy icons, incredible journeys. It's for individuals, small business and networkers to tell the... To tell, oh, to tell their adventures. Fantastic. Anita, that would be lovely, my dear. Don't put yourself out. But anything that you can do just to let everybody know. I would love to see, there's, there's a few billion people on Facebook. I would like a night when we all join us. Uh, Hamish Scar says, I've got a hymn for tonight, Scotty, uh, for the Sabbath. Wonderful. Now, Hamish is a great um, mouth organist. Tremendous. Madge is fine, says Majid Wahid. Fantastic. Thanks, Madge. And uh, Neil B says, Shabbat, Scotty. So there we are, Neil. Dinky do, I say. And, uh, and of course, Shalom and Salam. So there we are. Wonderful to have you with us. And Dinky do, I say. If you've just joined us, Scotty McClure, quick Sunday night pop-up just for you and uh, let us know what you're thinking. Tell me what you're doing as you're watching the programme. Not if it's obviously a wee bit personal, you know. Don't tell me about that. But tell us like, if you're watching television or chatting to your granny and your auntie Fanny or just whatever you're doing, do let us know, dinky do. I say that would be wonderful. And um, <coughs> Scotty... Why the heck aren't you on the launch of the new BBC Scotland channel? You'd be the class act it needs. David Baldwin, I was watching the launch tonight. I've sent congratulations to um, all at BBC Scotland on the launch of their channel. I wasn't invited along to a night at the theatre. So there you are. But I mean, I'm not taking that personally. I don't, just because they didn't manage to get me in the list. There'd be thousands of other people a lot more important than me that they'd want along at the launch of their channel. But maybe when they get going, you know, some smart programmer will say, hey, I'll tell you what we need here, Scotty McClure. 
So there you are. I think it'll be wonderful. Um, but good luck to BBC Scotland on the launch of their new television channel. Where were you walking the dog, says Rab? I think it was about bigger. Good one, Rab. I'm not going to tell anybody where I was walking the dog. I want everybody to guess. So look for Scotty McLeod's Sunday afternoon dog walking video on Facebook uh, live. And uh, and tell me, it looks lovely, says Thomas Hamilton. It is lovely, Tom. It was a wee bit misty, of course, so we didn't get the full bit. I thought the sun might just burn it off by that stage in the game. Um, administrating Scottish independence groups on Facebook, says Ian Johnston. Well, tell them all about Scotty McClure, Ian. We've all searching the internet for a hotel in Thailand, land of the smile, and listening to your good self, says Ian. Fantastic stuff. Dinky do. What else are you getting up to? As I say, I don't want anything personal, but do let us know what you're up to, big style. Is it time for me to go? Oh! No, we're all right. We're all right for a minute or two. Uh, I'd love a Scotty McClure chat show on BBC Scotland. We'll have to drop BBC Scotland folk a line. No, do, David. I mean, by all means, somebody, if everybody writes in and says, you know, can we get Scotty McClure on for a wee bit on your new channel? Or maybe even for a wee interview or something. That would be wonderful. I always fancied a, a wee cameo role in Still Game, you know? walking up to the bar of the clans and saying, Hello, Bobby. Hello, Scotty. What can I get you, sir? Oh, Bobby, I'll have a pint of your finest landlord. And um, for my pals here, you know, <laughs> for my pals here, nothing. You know, something like that. So there we are. So who knows what we'll get. Wonderful, wonderful stuff. Excellent. Right. Can we have one more massive share, please? Share, 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 share. And then I'll dash off. I'll let you go. I've got to get myself ready, uh, you know, sort of titivated, titivated up for the radio. Okay. This keeps getting interrupted. Very, very interesting. You should be on TV, pals, says Thomas Hamilton. Thank you, Thomas. What a lovely, lovely thing to say. And dinky do to every single one of you. It's fantastic. Wonderful. Now, I'm just wondering if I'm running out of juice on the phone, and that's why we seem to be losing it. Anyway, um, I'd better dash, so I shall uh, say the goodbye song for you. I wonder if we could manage it on the, um, could we manage it on the squeeze box for you? No, maybe not. Goodbye, everybody. Goodbye. Take care, everybody, as you go. Goodbye, everybody. A winter thing. Au revoir and a cheery oh. Good night, beautiful people. Lovely to be with us. Tell ten to tell ten to tell ten to tell ten about Scotty McClue saying dinky do just for you on Facebook Live. And uh, of course, send this round. Tell ten to tell ten to tell ten. Goodbye, everybody. And dinky do.